In the following video, you will learn about the available Soft1 tools which will give users ability to quickly and easily carry out the data searches. The search tools are available in the system bar, in the list browsers, in the work screens. Starting from the system bar, where various search options are available, you will notice that menu search, active browser and task search are automatically activated depending on the cursor focus. As an example, let's check out the active browser operation which is activated when data are displayed in a list. Type the part of the word you are seeking in our example, the characters FT, and see the results that contain these characters, regardless of the language used. The search applies in all available columns of the list. Continuing with search tools, in browsers just as in our example, you will find available filters by which you can search any record you are looking for. Select List or press Enter in order to search the results. Click on Filters if you wish to change the search criteria. In order to perform a search on a specific record or group of records, you can use the available search characters either individually or combined. These characters are the asterisk, the equal sign, a semicolon or question mark. If you know that part of the information you are looking for is either in the beginning or at the end, then your search should start or end with an asterisk. If you do not remember, then just place part of the information you are looking for between asterisks. Alternatively, you can use the equal sign. Use the semicolon to search for consecutive records. In addition, you can use the question mark to search for information in a specific position. For instance, search based on a customer code can be done by either using an asterisk or by typing question marks corresponding to the number of characters in the code you are looking for. Continuing with search tools, let's see a few more examples by using a sales document browser. In particular, to look for records by a date. You can use any date range from the default list. You can define your own date range. or use the calendar to pick a date. Using the calendar you can choose any month, previous or next by using the arrows. Click on the months to view all months of the year. Similarly, click on the year to select another year. To perform a search in drop-down list, choose the arrow as shown in the document type example. Then click on the types you were interested in. You can also search for a specific type by typing either its description. Finally, press Accept. If you know the code and you type it directly, you will see that it has also been automatically ticked in the table. In order to see only the types you have selected, click on True. For the types you have not selected, click on False. You can also select and deselect all. Another important search tool is the magnifying glass. You will see that the search is automatically activated as you type directly in the fields next to the magnifying glass. 
Additional search can be performed in all available columns. Use Clear Filters so that you clear all data and perform a new search. Bear in mind that through system settings you can set up parameters related to search tools. For example, selectors can open automatically while typing minimum characters needed for the search, as well as the number of lines displayed. You can also define which columns will be displayed every time you select the magnifying glass. For this you will need to mark as Default Selector a Soft One Browser. In our example, we have declared as Default Selector the specific Customer Browser from the Customer Module. Moreover, by right-clicking on the magnifying glass, you can choose from the pre-selected lists. These lists have group records based on the criteria you set when creating them. Finally, all the search tools can be used in all application searches, for instance in browser, printing or other work screens.